There's a lot going on in this video. We take a trip out to Massachusetts to visit up with Lee of Pure Hockey, and then he puts me to the test with a guess the glove challenge. And then we surprise my dad by getting him dressed head to toe in gold gear for oh, the yeah? first time ever. We're so hard about this, right? So buckle up and let's get after it. Yeah, so I'm in one of the largest stores in the company. It's, uh, it's pretty big. Yeah, right. <laughs> um, yeah, it helps. We got the uh, New England Sports Center right down the street. So it's got uh, eight full sheets, two studios. Right down the road? Right down the road. Eight so, sheets in the same building? Eight sheets. Oh my God. It's massive. It started at four, jumped to five, then went to six, and then they added two more. Yeah, they don't have anything like this, like just this store in Nashville, let alone a place with eight sheets like that in yeah. Nashville. Well, it helps um, with business and everything, but yeah, yeah it's uh, definitely Dude, just looking cool at things. this right here is exciting for me. Yeah. Like just the wall of pads, you definitely don't see that in Nashville either. We do like the most volume here in this location. Yeah. We're usually fully stocked up to the gills, but it's been crazy this year. So. Dude, this is sick. <laughs> yep, so we got uh, full synthetic mirrors, the whole nine. Uh, Very guys, well lit in here. Yeah, guys get to try some stuff on, get fit, make sure everything fits, you know, yeah. where they need it to be and perform the best. Dude, so I was just telling my dad on the way down here, like when I was getting into YouTube doing videos and stuff, I was watching your guys' videos. Yeah. Because you guys do such a great job like showing off the gear and no, that's you know, awesome. breaking down all the specs. So yeah, yeah. definitely use you guys a lot for like reference. <laughs> so it's kind of cool like coming in here and actually like looking yeah. at the store and walking around and stuff like that. Yeah, yeah, it's pretty surreal. You know, Wack and I were like, dude, let's do it. Let's just start making videos and Next thing you know, I'm in Detroit with like a learn to play event and some kid is like off to the side talking to his dad and he's like, hey man, um, do you mind saying hi to my son? I'm like, what? <laughs> he's like, yeah, he's a goalie. He's like a huge fan. I'm like, fan? I'm like, what are you talking yeah, about? Yeah, right. I'm an average Joe, like, like <laughs> take it easy. I'm you like, got a big beard though and that's... Yeah, I mean, that's the, that's the cool part built in dangler but <laughs> yeah right um, no you guys been doing a great job with your videos yeah and, stuff, so and hopefully definitely cool to see hopefully obviously with everything that's happened over the last you know year and a half like we'll start to get back to normal we do have a bunch of stuff that's like filmed we just haven't been able to get everything all together yeah um, so we're hoping to get back to it once the world starts to get a little nice a little, a little normal well what do you think man you want to start trying on some gloves yeah yeah, we can do some stuff. Um, do a little thing, go blindfold it, see if I can guess some brands. Guess, uh, guess the glove. Yeah, we could do that. Um, Got a blindfold I can use, or? Let's see. Let's see. Might be able to grab like a hockey sock. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so we got to guess the glove challenge. Yep. It's going to be passing me a couple different gloves. I'm going to try to guess the brand. Yep, brand. Yeah, we're not going to worry too much about break, but. Yeah, I don't know if I can get too far into that. Yeah. <laughs> I might I might try to guess a couple breaks here and there, Yeah. But we'll see. I think you should be all right. Yeah, So, but got the old blindfold here. All right. And I definitely can't see anything in this. Can't so. see? No, not at all. All right, so we're going to start with number one. The glove number one. It's either a... It's one of my personal favorites. Yeah? It's got to be either a, a Warrior or a Bryant. I want to take a guess. I feel like that's a Bryant. That is a Bryant. Yeah? Which Bryant? Oh, oof. <laughs> that's going to be the tough guess. I think it's a genetic? False. False, you not a genetic. An optic. An optic. Yeah. Oh. More of that whole hand closure. I mean, that's a beauty glove. I love that glove. I'm just glad I guessed the brand. <laughs> <laughs> That's right. cozy though. Yeah, love this glove. Uh, glove number two. Glove number two. Glove number two. Let's see how we feel. All right, did you just, oh what? wow. 
my personal glove. This is yours. Same one that I use, actually. Yeah. I'm gonna say uh, Warrior. Yeah. Yeah, that's a Warrior. Nailed it. <laughs> This is your personal glove. I use the GT2 myself. Yeah. yeah. So you, I've yeah. actually never really tried to use a Warrior glove before. I've heard a lot of great things about it. Yeah. Yeah. The funny thing is, is uh, when I ordered my set, I got G4s, but yeah. I purposely waited for the GT2 glove to come out because um, I got to check it out, see it, feel it, and just fell in love with it. Yeah. So definitely one of my favorites. Nice, dude. Yeah. So I'm two for two now. Two for two. Not yeah. A big deal. Uh, Let's give another one. Oof. This is gonna be tough. Oh, and actually this, this feels oddly familiar. <laughs> uh, is this a CCM glove? It is a CCM. 590. Yeah. A, a little older, right? Is this a E-Flex? It is not. It is not an E-Flex. No. Oh. P2. The old P2. <laughs> you know, my buddy Goose has the P2. Okay. And he, he loves this thing. Yeah. That's always the tough thing with CCM is because you can put any brake in any glove. Right. It's like you've got the brake, right? But you never know what the graphic's going to be until you feel it. <laughs> I kind of I kind of like that about them. It's, yeah. it's the same across the board. It doesn't really matter which model you get. Yep. And you but know, I just having those people. three breaks, you find your break and you can just yeah. kind of stick with it. Yeah. So three for three, look at you. All Big right. fan of the 590. You're nailing it though. Oh, is that, that's a different break altogether. Yeah. That's, uh, that's like that Vaughn break. That's got to be a Vaughn glove, just based on the break. <laughs> yep. Is it? It is. Nailed it. SLR3, baby. <laughs> yeah. This is the, this is the, uh, the curveball. Well, like, Vaughn is, in my opinion, very well known for that break that they have. Kind yep. of that 600 break. Yep. And uh, I had a 600 uh, CCM, E-Flex. Yeah. And it was my first time in a 600, and I and I really liked it. But then once I switched to the 590, it was it was over. Yeah, night and day. Yeah. Sweet. You're killing it, dude. All right, one more. It's got to be a Bauer. That's definitely not a Bauer. <laughs> that. <laughs> <laughs> That is a very well broken in glove. <laughs> this has got to be, uh, I'm going to say mid eighties. Yep. Um, I mean, the only vintage stuff I've actually worn is Cooper. This doesn't feel like a Cooper glove. It is not. As far as brand, ah, oh, DR. <laughs> <laughs> Just yeah, a wild you, guess. Uh, you, you nailed it. Yep. You got the giant basket. It is the DR. <laughs> this is really cool. The old Grant Fear special. It's cool <laughs> to see like the difference from the vintage gear to the modern gear. I mean, yeah. like even just little pieces like this yep. adding to that shape. Yeah. It's cool to see like where it's come and how it's progressed into what we have now. Yeah, right. You know, it's pretty sweet. Big fan of the vintage stuff, man. Yeah. I love playing with vintage gear. <laughs> That's so cool. Nailed it. So I nailed all of them. You nailed all of them. You want one more? We got one more. You want to add one more? Let's try one more. Oh, that's a cozy glove too. See, that's got that Vaughn feel to it. I, oh, we haven't tried a Bauer yet. I feel like there's got to be a Bauer at some point, <laughs> but like. A Bauer? It is a Bauer. Team All right. Um, Hyperlite. False. Oh. It's actually the 2S. The so 2S. The yeah. So I tried out Kane Van Gates' uh, pads that he brought to Nashville. Yeah. And I tried on his glove, and I was pretty impressed other than the fact that it caught with the wrong hand. But yeah, yeah. Should have been a blocker. Should have been a blocker. <laughs> yeah. Nice, dude. Yeah. Yeah. 
Not a big deal. I mean, you did nail it. Old Bonesy for the win here. You won. So, uh, cool. I don't know, got, got my dad behind the camera here. What do you think about getting him completely fitted for some gear? You want a head to toe? Head to toe. We could do head to toe. All right, let's do it. Let's do it. Yeah. <laughs> want to help support Bonesy TV? Use the Pure Hockey link in the description for all your online hockey purchases, and this channel will automatically receive a kickback. Link in description. So we're actually going to use the Bauer scanner. Gonna scan up your feet. All right. This is actually going to tell us your size as well as a fit to be in. All right, you can step off. It's going to give you a full 3D image of your foot. Wow, look at those messed up feet. <laughs> <laughs> you got ones uh, yeah, just like them. <laughs> you're pretty average, believe it or not. You're actually not terrible. So you actually got two different sized feet. I didn't never knew that. I never knew, right? All right. So it's great to be able to use like the scanner as a tool because we can actually see the reason why your left foot is actually longer. because uh -huh. your left arch actually falls down, whereas your right arch is actually pretty up. So okay. when your foot flattens, it gets longer and wider. So this is going to put you in a 10 and a half fit three. So just because you have a fairly wide ball of your foot, right? that's going to cause that skate to be a little bit wider throughout. Mm -hmm. Just keep it a little bit more comfort. So let's get, uh, let's get some wheels on you. Now, have we ever played goalie before? Uh, well, we did a lot of pond hockey. That's about as far okay. as all the goalie we had. Uh, I was going to say, how did- The old did... standard Mylek gear. Oh yeah. <laughs> I was going to say, how did this guy get to be a goalie? I think uh, it started with youth uh, soccer. Okay. And uh, they stuck him in goal one day, and I think that was, that, <laughs> I think that was it. That's the end of it? Yeah, that was the end of it. That's funny. Well, it it's helps funny, that like... this, this guy used to throw socks at me in the doorway when he's folding up that's socks. The, yeah. uh, that's the other story. Is, uh, <laughs> when he was uh, really young, we used to do, doing laundry, we used to roll up socks, and yep. used to throw them to him, he would just... <laughs> <laughs> That became a game. I was yeah, like, yeah. Okay. And the rest is history. <laughs> That's awesome. Yeah. yeah like my uh, my dad was a goalie. My uncle was a goalie. Oh yeah. Their cousins were goalies. Like I'm literally bred from goalies. Uh, and the only reason why is because once you get old enough and you have somebody below you, you force them to wear the pads right, so you can right, shoot right. on them. Hand me down. Yeah. Right. Yeah. There you so go. a lot of times playing street hockey with my dad shooting on me just because he didn't want to be in the net anymore. <laughs> So, we're actually gonna stay seated. All, All right, right how much? Too. How much are these? Are those skates? Yeah. You don't wanna know. Okay. No. <laughs> Stop right there. Yeah, those guys, <laughs> those are uh, 849. Okay, yeah, all right. This is the ultrasonic. Now, we're gonna get a little fancy here with our elastic toe ties. It's gonna help with extra rotation as well as taking a lot of stress on right. your knees and your hips. All right. You know, it's not just how well you play, it's how long you can play. You know, and definitely being in my 30s, I'm definitely feeling the effects of not wearing knee pads and oh, all yeah. that stuff from when I was younger. So, try to teach the next generation. I'm so proud of him right now. He's doing so good. They grow up so fast. <laughs> Do his first pads. My very first. <laughs> Oh, looking sharp right. already. So, first thing. What do you think? How do we feel? A little Aww. different, yeah, of course. <laughs> now I can see why goalies walk like this. You know yeah, right? <laughs> uh, starting you off in a 33, especially okay. for guys that uh, are just getting into it. I always recommend go a little bit smaller with stuff. Get your fundamentals, get your movements. Don't worry about size. Right. You know, size is only as good as the first shot. After that first shot. Now you gotta move, right? You know. Yeah. So for a good, like, ideal fit, we want it to be roughly in the middle of our thighs, which okay. we're sitting pretty which good. Which it is. Yep. Right. Do you want to do a butterfly? <laughs> no. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> no let me stretch out a little bit yeah, yeah. first. <laughs> let's have. Right, I'll so get there. Let's yeah. Let's have you like if you want to like pretend or like go down nice and slow. I don't want you slamming your knees down. Yeah. There you go. So try to flip that over just a little bit. There, there you go. go. Okay. Yep. Yeah. Yep. Look at that. So we'll get this one over here like yeah. this. Oh, look at, look that. at that. What's so hard about this? Right? <laughs> this is my dad's first butterfly. Right? 
Like we're not looking terrible, yep. right? You're one of the uh, odd cases where you have long thighs, right? So you'd be a player that would benefit from that plus two, right? Your knee's in a great spot in terms of landing. When we think about like where we hit, we're not hitting here, right? We're hitting back here. Right. So that's the key is we want to hit as center onto that knee stack as possible. Okay. That's going to give us the best stability, Yep. right? And the best mobility. This 33 looks great on the knee. Maybe just a little bit more up top we need to help close that five hole. Again, we haven't stretched, right? Right. We haven't, yes, actually, we, have not. we haven't actually played before, but I mean, everything's looking good so far. How do okay. we feel? There's no pinching, there's no rubbing, there's no- Nothing uncomfortable. You know, nothing uncomfortable. Yeah. I'm saying these aren't gonna work. Yeah, yeah. it's looking pretty good. All right. <laughs> All right. Yeah, this is the challenge now. Yeah, easy now. Getting easy, back up. Easy, easy. <laughs> There you go. <laughs> He's gone. I was waiting for the kick to come up. Right, well, uh, I have my counterweights, you know. <clears throat> yeah. Cool. Price tag, uh, we don't want to know. Yeah. <laughs> that little guy, don't worry about that little guy. Uh, yeah, 900. let's have you try on a chesty. <laughs> Didn't think you were putting gear on today, did you? <laughs> yeah, no, I did. You know, when I, uh, you know. When you got out of bed this morning. Really? Huh? You know, I feel like putting on some hockey gear today. I mean, I can put the AC on if you do get hot. You shouldn't need it, though. <laughs> You got some length to your arms, right? We're pretty lanky. So this is an extra large. Okay. Let me try this. All right. Perfect. Let's have you slide your arm right in. Cool. Wait. Wow. All right. <laughs> right? Now well, you don't look like Vasilevsky, which is good. All right, we don't have the beer. Yeah, we don't have the beer belly. Yeah. <laughs> but as we can see, we get some pretty good size, as well as we got a pretty good fit. Okay. Now, <clears throat> this may feel a little bulky, right? Elbows, right? right? Think of yeah. that six and seven hole. So it helps kind of close that off a little bit. How's it feel movement wise? Yeah, I feel pretty good. You know, feel I feel pretty like good. A, like a transformer here. That <laughs> <laughs> was a classic yeah. reference. So I mean, it's a, there's just an incredible amount of padding. Yep. Yeah, and so what we look for in terms of fit is we want that to sit roughly around the ball of the wrist, which we're sitting in a good spot. Yep. We want to be right around the belt buckle. Yep. Right we're there. Which is we're everything's there. landing where we want it to. Very cool. How we feel? <laughs> yeah, good. Looking like a yeah. goalie. I know, yeah. we're, we're almost there. Now I told you I wouldn't put you in pants just because it was going to complicate okay, things. Okay, yeah. Get too big. Right. But get the old glove and blocker going. You got to look in the mirror, man. <laughs> <laughs> right. <laughs> you, do we want to do a helmet? Yeah, sure. <laughs> we got to get a helmet on We got to get a helmet. Get the full effect here. <laughs> uh, hang on, this is a, uh, this is a, uh, hang on. Well, it's kind of comfy. It's got a. Yeah? What do you think? I think it's a. Hang on. Oh yeah, it's the CCM. Oh, dude, you nailed it. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah. <laughs> oh, this is a Flex 5.9 for sure. Yeah. So you don't. I'm not saying you have a big head. But you get a decent sized head. So let me try this. See how this looks. Oh, oh dude, look at that. That yeah. actually fits pretty damn well. What do you well. think? <laughs> Look at that. It actually looks pretty good, I'm not yeah. gonna lie. Yeah, it sits right on the sides of the cheek. Yep. Okay. Nose is just off the cage. Yep, yep. Uh, nice salt and pepper look under there. Yeah. <laughs> Heads encapsulated. Totally Ears ready for the, the senior hole. league here. Yeah. <laughs> How's it feel? Good, yeah. You know. <laughs> as good as you've ever thought it would be? Ready to take a hit. <laughs> yeah, right, exactly. This is awesome. Yeah. All right, cool. All right, we got a, we got one last piece. Missing something. I'm missing something here. <laughs> Not quite sure exactly what it is. There it is. Oh, last Bauer. piece. All right. Look at that. Bringing it all together. What do you think? <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Ready to samurai? There it is. <laughs> yeah. Is that he the is right ready. glove? Do I have it this way? It's just gonna no, be. No, you, you had it right the first time. Yeah. There it is. Look at that. Bring it. NHL, here we come. Yes, That's right. right. He's got nothing on Come you. on, Marshan. <laughs> <laughs> you got nothing, buddy. I'm waiting for you. I've been waiting all the long time. Man. This is awesome. <laughs> yeah, man, looking good. That's awesome. So this is a great fit. 
That's uh, right pads here. feel good, you know. Gloves got to break in. Got some, got some good mobility, obviously. Yeah. So yeah, this uh, CCM, uh, I love it. <laughs> Absolutely love it. <laughs> I don't know when I get here. I love it. So oh. awesome. Sweet. Very cool. Now you, gotta, now you gotta get it all off. Yeah. Yeah. Now you want. Now why parents always wonder why their kids take so long to get undressed? Yeah, right. Right. It takes forever. I take all the stuff off. <laughs> yeah. So I gotta give a huge thanks to Lee and Pure Hockey. But make sure you stick around for the blooper segment at the end of this video. Got another fun bit with my dad. But again, huge thanks to Lee for showing us around the shop, letting me try on a few different gloves, and then getting my dad dressed out. I know my dad and I had a ton of fun, and hopefully you had a ton of fun watching this video. If you're ever in the Massachusetts area, make sure you visit Lee at Pure Hockey. The store is absolutely massive, and they have a huge selection of bowling gear. If you've been to this store already, let me know what you think in the comments below. Please don't forget to subscribe, as always. We'll see you around. All right, we're going to do ready. a test here. Ready? Yeah. All right. The blindfold test. We're going to do the blind test here. Yeah. If I can figure these out. Okay. Yeah, this is a curveball. You're, you're probably right, not going to guess this ball. one. Give me a curveball. Yeah. All right. You ready? All right. Oh, yeah. There you go. Okay. All right. Okay. No way you're going to know this one. Okay. All right. Let me see. Let me get my hand in here. I feel the, feel the vibe here. I think it's got a, it's got kind of a nice hinge to it. Uh, not that comfy. Yeah. I feel like, uh, uh, hang on. Uh, TPS? Wow, TPS? no way. Hang on, let me see if I can figure out the. Uh, just kind of have to go with TPS. I, you know what? You got it. Can you guess the color? Get out. Um, let's see again. <laughs> They're red. It's got to be red. No way. I'm allergic to red. <laughs> <laughs> that is 100% correct. That is a red oh TPS God. glove. Get out of here. Yeah. How? How Hang did on. you? Get out. <laughs> <laughs> Unbelievable. <laughs>